Souls games never make co-op and playing with friends very simple, so real quick we'll go over how to summon friends to play co-op in Elden Ring. When you're at the very start of Elden Ring, right before going up the lift to the main map, you'll acquire the Furled Finger and the Finger Severer from a corpse, which are two of the three items you will need in order to summon your friends. For our third item, all we need to do is head over to the Church of Ella in order to obtain a crafting kit, which you can get by talking to Santa Claus over in the corner. The crafting kit costs 300 runes, which really isn't much, but if you need some runes, just go kill some enemies and come back. Now we can pause the game and access the item crafting menu and craft a Furl Calling Finger Remedy. We can also obtain this Furl Calling Finger Remedy from Kale, that NPC that looks like Santa Claus, who we got the crafting kit from, but it'll cost a thousand runes. Instead, just open up your crafting menu and craft the Finger Remedy yourself. You may need two of these flowers, which you can get around the starting area of Elden Ring, and they're just golden glowing flowers planted around the area. I usually find them close to the church where we got the crafting kit from. They're easily confused with those yellow flowers that you can't pick though, so don't mix them up. Now that you have the Furl Calling Finger remedy, you're ready to play co-op with your friend. All we're going to do is open up the pause menu and scroll down to multiplayer, and you're going to look at the right hand side, and you and your co-op friend both want to type the same multiplayer password, but not something super simple, otherwise someone else might join you. If you want to join random co-op partners, you don't have to type anything here. After you type that, if you want to join your co-op friend, you're going to click on the tarnished furled finger, and place a summon sign on the ground. If you want to host the game and have your co-op friend join you, you're going to click on the Furl Calling Finger Remedy and it will display all of the summon signs that are using that password. And if you didn't type a password, it'll show a bunch of different summon signs of co-op partners to choose from. Just touch the gold summon sign when it gives you the option to and it'll allow your co-op friend to be summoned and join your online game. But yeah, that's how you play co-op and summon your online friends in Elden Ring. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more Elden Ring tips and guides. See ya.